Welcome to Inside Northeast Racing. To start off the show, we'd like to congratulate the newest generations of winners from this past weekend. At the Bethel Motor Speedway, it was Jessica Ricky. And at the Woodhall Raceway, Dylan Groover. Congratulations to both of you. Our friends at the Empire Lightning Sprint started off their season, and Justin Phillips was the lucky winner. Rain short in the Accord Speedway night. Here's the Sportsman feature from this past Friday. Here we go here in this Sportsman feature go round. So Will Dietz, who looks so good, and oh look out, three deep off the turn. Ricky trying to split him, and McCloskey on the bottom. Rich Mickey the third tries to split him as they come off the turn. Dietz on the outside, McCloskey right there in second, down into the turn, Ricky is there. Then it's Kloski's outside of him as they come off the turn. Dietz on the bottom, McCloskey with a triple nickel on the outside, the 555, and McCloskey is now going by to grab the lead. So McCloskey down into the turn, Johnson a little bit, and down on the inside, Ricky has now pulled in to grab second. Ricky the third down on the bottom was second. Ward on the outside now draws dead even with him as they go down into three. Ricky bonsaiing around the bottom. That's not going to be good enough. Johnson will be in at third. Barrett will be fourth. Right now Dietz has come back to be fifth. And Ricky's going to be sixth. It's Greg McCloskey picking up the win. Ward will get there for that number two position. As they drive to the turn, Johnson is going to be third. 44 of Barrett, 4, Dietz 5th, and Ricky will be 6th. Other winners at the Accord Speedway were Vinny Viscani, Demetrius Drellos, and following a post-race inspection, Ryan Stortini is named the winner of the Spec Sportsman feature. Now here's one you don't want to miss. This Sunday, Devil's Ball Speedway hosts the Sparing Green 114 for ACT Late Models. While rain forced many tracks to cancel this past Saturday, Bethel Motor Speedway said, let's race. Here's a musical look at this past weekend's action from Bethel.
The winners at Bethel Motor Speedway were Mark Sylvester in the Pro Stocks, David French in the Bandolero, Sean Maloney in the Four Cylinders, Joseph Graff in the Legends, Willie Nickerson in the BMS Modifieds, Jackie Brown Jr. in the Rare Appearance in the Sportsman, Kevin Skelly in the Street Stocks, and Mike Bryant in the Four Cylinder Novice. Now it's time for some NASCAR action. Here's Mike Mallett with a call from Utica Rome's opening night. It's Jimmy Phelps. How about it, ladies and gentlemen? We are ready to go. Three laps to the distance here this evening. Race fans, as I ask you each and every Sunday night as I work the way up of turn number four to the green. Ladies and gentlemen, who is it going to be? Jimmy Phelps settles into second. Then it is a side-by-side -side battle for the number three spot, making a three-car race. Now it's here comes to a freezing down low. Freezing, Shepard, very white, white to the high side. Shepard through the middle, freezing on the inside. Down the back stretch, it will be Stuart Freezing now taking over third. That Shepard down low. Shepard muscles his way by his teammate, Jimmy Phelps, through three wide up and turn number four with two laps to go. Taking up the victory here on opening night. Got the number 33 is Mike Mahaney. Second goes to Stuart Friesen. Third. Off of turn number four will go to Matt Shepard. Fourth. Jimmy Phelps, fifth, and Zoe Decker. Sixth. You definitely had her in that one. You were battling with the best of the best. First you had to muscle your way by Jimmy Phelps, and then you get a caution, and you got Stuart Friesen knocking on the door. Yeah, you know, there's, uh, at this place, there's nobody you worse to have behind you than the number one car, but uh, boy, we had a fast hot rod tonight, and uh, can't, can't thank uh, my and my mom and my whole family enough uh, just for giving me this ride to run here. And uh. Other winners at Utica Rome were A.J. Philbeck, Tom Denton, and Ron Hawker. That about does it for this week. Look for our cameras at Accord, Utica Rome, and don't forget this Sunday at Devil's Bowl Speedway for the Spring Green 114. Until next week, keep racing.